One of the toughest topics to understand when we deal with security appliance is probably the world of certificates, a digital certificates. Why? Because understanding certificates means that you have to understand what is asymmetric encryption, asymmetric encryption, and hash functions. Now, we will start with a video series that will try to lighten up the issue and we will start with a basic uh, introduction to symmetric encryption. We will do it using OpenSSL. So a symmetric encryption means, and that is the very basic meaning, that we take a plain text, we use an algorithm, which is a mathematical function that uses substitution and uses transpositioning, and we are using a key, a key that is known to both parties. The key is the same. Later on, we will deal with the key space and what does it mean. And now we will take the plain text and we will use the algorithm together with the key to turn it into a cipher text. So if we'll open up a text file, and let's write down Fortinet secret key. And now let's um, save it. Let's save the file as Fortinet. Let's open it again, just to make sure that we have the plain text. And now let's use OpenSSL. Let's use AES128, AES is a symmetric encryption algorithm. In our case, we are using a key space of 128 bits, that is two to the power of 128. And let's insert the 40 net text and let's output a cipher text. Let's call it cipher 40 net. We are asked to insert a password. The password is not the key. The password is part of the key derivation. So let's enter the password. Let's enter it again. And now we have a ciphertext. Let's look at the ciphertext. We have called the ciphertext cipher fortnet. And there it is, that's the encrypted plain text.